alert hello guys welcome back to the channel hope you are having a great weekend so far so uh, I just noticed this pattern when I was checking out uh, my uh, you know some stocks that we talked about last week and on your screen we have uh, Excel technologies that we pulled up and uh, check this out so uh, on Friday uh, June 17th the stock closed during normal trading hours at 14 cents and that represented a drop of 0.77 percent but in the after hours the stock went up 6.08 percent that is significant guys over the past two weeks we have tested the 52 week lows so many times I lost count but over the past two days I would say yeah the past two trading sessions we have seen a steady increase in the stock valuation of Excella Technologies. But don't just go by the increase in the value of the stock. Take a look at the volume here on the bottom left of your page. You will see that the amount traded went up to 92 million shares that exchange hands compared to an average volume of 38.9 million shares that would typically exchange hands. Similarly, the market capitalization of the company also rose all the way up to $62 million. Yes, it's still a very far cry from the all-time highs or the 52-week highs. But remember that uh, the 52-week range is from $0.12 cents all the way up to $5.45. So for me, what is significant is that a lot of action probably took place in the after hours. That's after the regular trading was done. And Monday is Juneteenth, which uh, is a public holiday in the United States. The stock market will be closed. So it's Tuesday that's going to be the earliest that we can start trading on Excella Technologies. And I am thinking that some whales already set themselves up for success because next week I suspect that Excella Technologies might start running. So... I don't know what trade you guys placed, but I am just uh, putting this video out there like an alert so that um, come Tuesday, you are ready to pounce on Excella in case we see any significant movement. The last PR we got was that we have a new uh, gentleman by the name of Mr. Lakshmi, who is in charge of bills and payments. Prior to that, you had the Series B preferred stock that, were, that received some dividends and uh, since then it's just been a little bit of silence but uh, once Excella Technologies reached the 12 cents range, range I knew that its company is way way more valuable than 12 cents a share and uh, it's worth way more than the 50 million dollars it was showing as uh, the market capitalization and uh, now we are seeing some action and uh, it's happening in the after hours so what that tells me is that somebody waited until they could get their you know shares at a very steep bargain and then they went heavy probably not all in but heavy uh, pending you know the pre-hour trading on monday uh, again excella is a business transaction company they help facilitate uh, transactions between businesses and businesses and also between businesses and individuals they are based out of irving in texas and uh, at, as of last time I checked, they had about between 16,000 to 17,000 employees and they, have, they do have a global footprint. So, a very big company uh, with a lot going on and I think uh, with uh, the world reopening after two years of a lockdown and uh, right now the conflict that's taking place in uh, Europe between Russia and Ukraine, uh, we are still going to see some tumultuous days uh, and even months before uh, the world c goes back to anything of uh, being normal. So, guys, this is just an alert so that uh, you put this, make a little note somewhere. Uh, that way, Tuesday in the pre-market, you take a quick look at Excella and see what it is doing. I think it's going to run hard next week. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have any position in Excella and uh yeah that's what i had for you guys hope you have a great weekend thanks to those who uh keep on subscribing our numbers are going up we fixed for ourselves a target of 
a thousand subscribers by the midterms in November and hopefully we can hit that target with your help. Bye now.